everyone Henry from Smoky Hills Outdoor Store with a super super exciting custom bulb this is the kind of house that makes me excited to see what customers come up with it's a ZR17 so it's completely custom our customers looked at a ZR21 and said you know I'd love to have that in a 17 foot house well here it is super awesome house doesn't feel enclosed and I'll show you the inside in just a second so let's start fiberglass arctic installation obviously electric awning with the LED light strip and then one of the options a lot of times we tend to forget about is the galvanized spare tire here and it comes straight from the factory of course on this beautiful galvanized frame so next time you're building a house maybe ask the guys about the mounted spare tire whether it's a regular or a galvanized tire it's a cool thing to have we're gonna head to the middle here you've been seeing these guys this is actually the first time I've seen the um, plastic wheel well the new plastic wheel well we see them in the 21 foot houses the tandem axles all the time and now we're seeing them in a single axle hydraulic looks really sleek this whole design just looks sleek especially with the ZR21 decals it makes the house shine but it doesn't detract too much from it in the back here's something new and fun a mounted hose holder for your sewer hose definitely a good thing to have because I never know what to do with mine. I usually have a tube and it goes in the back of my truck, but uh, I like this design. So Justin, let's head inside and show everybody how awesome this house is. I'm gonna start here in the back, just because there's so much to see. I'm gonna close this up just a little bit. First thing, it's really hard to believe that this is actually a 17 foot house. I gotta be honest with you. And a big part of that, obviously, is going to be the hydraulics and the sofa in the back. I think having that bench right there is such a cool idea because it makes this area just feel massive. It's also a great spot to sit and just when you come and visit somebody uh, and the sofa on the back makes it really, really, really easy to sit here and jig. And this one, the holes actually sit in a good spot. A lot of people ask me, why aren't the holes with a, a, a way this much or to the left or to the right? Simple answer is the frame. There's lots of supports under the frames. You know, they're building them better and better every year. We really don't have any issues with frames. And those frames are going to be in the way of some of these holes. So the frame is really going to dictate where you can move the holes. So there's just a little bit of info there. Electric lift bed above me. Nice big electric lift bed. We hit it with the cabinets, which I do like. Um, of course, there's a cedar inside with a vinyl floor. We've got a nice full kitchen, double sink. They did a really good job with this house. Um, you know, we were just commenting that the build and the fit and finish on this house really does look very, very good. Um, I'm, I'm really happy with it. Upgraded stove, so we've got the oven, burner, everything stainless steel, including the fridge. And then, of course, here's the winner up front, double bunks. This also has two voltmeters, one for the um, hydraulic battery and then one for the regular battery. We've got TV hookups down here. We've got cupboards down here. Let me show you. Here's my cupboard. And then on the other side, I have my TV hookups. I'll get out of the way so you can see them. And, of course, remember, this can fold up as well. So if uh we we have enough space and i always tell people the space down here is actually adequate for me to sleep in i'm about six foot and i can sleep here i would actually enjoy it it's uh, nice and quiet back here as well and then don't forget we've got a bathroom flush toilet and this even has an on-demand water heater if you look on the left there you can see the control panel and it's got the fart fan so that's always a nice option. I would say that this has to be my favorite 17 foot house of all time, without a doubt. Uh, the customers knocked it out of the park. Uh, Nate's design was fantastic on this house. And then of course, uh, Ice Castle just, just absolutely killed it on this house. They did such a phenomenal job. Um, this is not a cheap house. So by the way, this is a, a, this is a pretty loaded up house. But if you're looking for 17 foot, but you still want that 21 foot 
openness and the bunks in the front this is going to be it absolutely without a doubt my favorite 17 foot house ever built if you want the rv package so i hope everybody enjoyed the video i enjoyed doing it um if you have any questions you know we always watch the comments on our videos and we'd love to hear what you have to say uh we also have a zr18 uh that will be, will be coming up at some point but uh yeah keep watching we always love to do new stuff thanks everyone